Modern Verizon routers broadcast on two distinct frequency bands, 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz. Understanding these bands is crucial for optimizing your network performance. The 2.4 GHz band offers longer range and better wall penetration, making it ideal for smart home devices and IoT gadgets that need extended coverage throughout your home. In contrast, the 5 GHz band delivers much faster speeds up to 1.3 gigabits per second with less congestion, making it perfect for streaming, gaming, and high bandwidth applications. Separating these bands gives you precise control over your network. You can manually assign devices to the optimal band, improve troubleshooting, and ensure legacy devices connect properly. Modern Verizon routers like the Fios Home Router CR1000A series feature advanced band separation capabilities with user-friendly interfaces and seamless integration with the My Verizon mobile app. There are two main methods to separate your Verizon router bands. First, let's cover the web interface method. Start by accessing your router's admin panel through a web browser. Navigate to one of these addresses in your browser. You'll see an interface similar to this Verizon router login screen. Log in using your admin credentials. These are typically found on a label on your router, usually on the back or bottom of the device. Here's what the back of a typical Verizon router looks like, where you'll find the login information along with the cable connections. Once logged in, navigate to the wireless settings section. Look for options labeled wireless, Wi-Fi settings, or advanced settings depending on your router model. The key step is to disable band steering or Smart Connect. This feature automatically manages which band your devices connect to, but disabling it allows you to create separate network names. Finally, configure each band with unique names. For example, name your networks My Network Score 2.4G and My Network 5G. Keep the same password for both networks for convenience. Here's an example of what your router's Wi-Fi information label might look like after configuration, showing both the 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz network names along with the password. Alternatively, you can use the My Verizon mobile app for a more convenient approach. This method provides the same functionality through your smartphone. The My Verizon app provides an intuitive interface for managing your Wi-Fi settings, you can see connected devices and easily toggle between different network configurations. Regardless of which method you choose, remember to apply your settings and restart your router to complete the process. You'll then need to reconnect your devices to the appropriate network bands for optimal performance.